Hey everybody, Tails here, and my god, I have a bunch of stuff from my birthday, from Goodwill, and a few other places, which I'll uh, mention later, but I got an, a lot of this this weekend, and I'm going to show it to you all. So first up, I'm going to start with my stuff I got for my birthday. Um, first, I have the Sega Dreamcast collection for the 360. I got this for my birthday. I have two sealed copies, um, Super Mario 3D Land and A Link Between Worlds, Legend of Zelda. I have this Lego set, um, Benny's Space Squad, for Lego Movie 2, because I really like space related stuff, and Benny's actually my favorite character from the Lego Movie. Um, next up, <laughs> oh, where should I start? Um, I'll actually start with the stuff I got from the yard sale. I have all these comic books. There's uh, regular show in Adventure Time. And these were all for $2. So, that is awesome. Um, next one, let's see. Oh, yeah. I have these water speakers right over here. Two, two perfectly good water speakers. And can't even remove it because there's, like, a bunch of stuff around all over the place. So I'll just leave it there for now. And another thing I have is a... Guitar Hero guitar, not even the... Karen can get the entire thing. Alright, here we go now. This thing is huge. And I've always wanted one of these. This is actually for a Wii, but I'll get a game for it. Put that to the side. Um, I also have this, uh, Super Mario Bros. Super Show, Mario the Deep. This is the only, like, DVD I could find, best DVD. I've, I haven't even, uh, checked the condition of this. Bit scratched, but I could I could probably get it resurfaced. Maybe I should get a disc resurfacing machine. I've always like wanted to get one. And next up, I have these um duck earbuds. They also had like mac and cheese versions, but I just got these ones because my old ones are kind of getting worn out. And I'll also like keep these in case if uh, I need spare earbuds. So yeah, that's cool. And now for all the stuff I found at uh, Goodwill. Oh wait, I forgot couple others this sealed lego set it's a creator set it's actually a four juniors but yeah whatever <laughs> this was sealed surprisingly it had like a security or not security tag um it had like a like a uh like a zip like those zip things i forget what they're called and uh it was like covered with it and i just removed it and i realized it was sealed sadly it doesn't have any value it's only like 27 bucks on ebay so i'm just gonna like build this set for uh, like my YouTube channel. I also always wanted these like big figures, which is why I got it. And another one, this is a whole set. I'll do this in another video, but this came with a whole bunch of Lego bricks and some uh, instructions and a whole bunch of minifigures, which I'll show you in my other video. So, yep, that's cool. All right, and now for all the stuff I got at Goodwill. First up, 2010, FIFA World Cup, South Africa. It's in pretty good condition. Next up, I have Tiger Woods PGA Tour uh, 2007 in the PS2 case. It looks really good. I have Max Payne, um, which is a good game. It's made by Rockstar Games. It's in a blockbuster case, but I'll probably get a replacement and remove that Sharpie and all. And the uh, instructions are a bit warped, but I can, like, flatten that a little for my collection. Alright. This one's my personal favorite. This uh, long box uh, PlayStation 1 case, which is a little bit different. It's a bit stained and all, but I can, like, fix it. And this thing's about to fall off, so I'll have to glue that in. And it's in really good condition, surprisingly. It even has this, like, protective thing over it. It's from this oldy town touty films place which i've never heard of probably like out of business or something like toys r us it has this like a little foam thing over here and the disc is in really good condition i'll just have to remove the sticker yeah i'm like all the ps1 games i got they're have like stickers on them and yeah i really got like three ps1 games there was like another one but i didn't grab it most of these were like three and two dollars uh, Nagano Winter Olympics 98, which I can't even open. Alright, now I can open it, which sadly has no instructions. I think it was just printed out or something. 
and yeah, it has like the like the back cover and everything, which looks nice. Might get a replacement or just at least clean it, but yeah, I just grabbed it because it was like super cheap. A few scratches, but it may work. If it doesn't work, I'll get it resurfaced. I have Triple Play 99 in the worst condition case ever. This thing is like broken and has tape over it. It's also stained too. And it has one of these things, and I tried removing them, but it's gonna, I feel like I'm gonna like rip this thing off. And once again, another sticker over here, but this is in pretty good condition. A few scratches, but I'll once again get it resurfaced or just play it like that. As long as it works, that's, what, that's the most important part. I have two extreme on the PS1, which actually looks pretty good. It's a bit stained, but I can I can once again clean it. And once again, these annoying stickers, this thing, I feel like I'm going to like peel it right off, as you can see, like right over here. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, I'm going to like try to remove that the best I can. And once again, good condition. Alright. And here's a CD. I thought this was a game, but it's actually... The soundtrack from uh, Batman and Robin. So I just grabbed it because why not? It was only like two dollars, which is why I bought it. And it's actually in pretty good condition. It may work. I'll listen to it a bit. Even though Batman and Robin's a terrible movie, I still got this anyway. Um, let me actually go with these three next. I have Personal Trainer Cooking. I have the Japanese version of this, which is why I bought it. There's Personal Trainer Cooking. All right, I make. Sh I was just making sure that this is the right one. Yep, and this is only two bucks, so I thought, why not? And I also got this game. I thought it was Burnout Legends, but it's actually Spider-Man 2, which is also... Oh, wait, this is this is the movie. I thought this was the game. Oh, well, it, it is a good movie, too, so... I haven't checked the condition on this, but let's see how this looks. I'm going to be careful with this, because these are very brittle. And it's in pretty good condition, so... If, when I get a PSP, I'll... <laughs> I thought this was the game at first, but it's actually the movie. As you can see right here, it's like a movie right over here. But yeah, it has the instructions and everything, so I'll just like get a loose copy of this and yeah, play it. So yeah, that's a pretty awesome find. And finally, for my DVDs and everything, a Sonic Underground DVD, The Queen Alina Chronicles, which has four episodes, as you can see right here. I'm collecting Sonic DVDs now, and uh, yeah, I'm, this one's sealed surprisingly, which is cool. Um, I finally found one of these. There were like a whole bunch of these. It's a 360 Connect for a 360. And it has a USB adapter, so I'll plug that in and see if it works. These were only five bucks, which is why I bought it. And uh, finally, I went, um, I was throwing something away and I found these. A Zelda poster and a Mario poster in the dumpster. These are like perfectly good posters. I also found a Minecraft and a Grumpy Cat, but I didn't take those. I just took these. And, uh, yeah, that's really it. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.